Right, folks, we are here at the Hall's Pumpkin Patch with T Man, Carla, JT, the wife, and we got Baby G. Right there, he is. All right. Go have fun. Let's go find us a pump. Can you not dump my phone out? I'll try. <laughs> or show me it. Uh, let's go find them. Uh, it should be fine. You got a little bit of moisture on the ground. Everything's wet. I seem to have lost my party. Let me go see if I can find that. About time y'all are coming. Well, we have the hundred dollar bill, but that's it. That's fine. I'm sure they got over 500 people out here paying what five, ten bucks a piece. They'll have change. This is going to be an exciting day. Brought the camera just in case because. Uh, here we got some exciting news coming that it's kind of a secret. I kind of know a little bit about it, but yet I don't. It's kind of one of those things that have been mentioned, so I figured I'd bring the camera out for a little bit of family fun and hope you guys enjoy. Like I said, this is Hall's Pumpkin Patch. This is our third attempt. If it wasn't gonna happen this time, it wasn't gonna happen, but it's gonna happen because we're gonna make it happen. This is a special day. And uh, for the family, hope y'all enjoy. And uh, I don't know what they got inside, but this is just out here in the field. Look at, look at all these pumpkins. I mean, they just have pallets and pallets and boxes of pumpkins. Uh, hay around, but I think we're going to miss it. Uh, the sign says they don't start till 5 p.m. And it's just now 125, so we probably won't be here for that, but that's okay. We'll get to the house. We're gonna have cook some chicken on the grill um clay quarters i also bought some uh, tenderloins today i went to the store and I had them on sale so uh, i love some tenderloin and look here i lost my party but now they beat me they're in front of me look at the line to get in there's probably 100 125 people over here it's gonna be a good day though pumpkins laid out all over the place they got you know bales of hay i don't know if you can buy those or what i have no idea but they got these weird looking things here those are actually pretty cool um it's corn stalks all right folks we're gonna go over here and get in line it's gonna be a it's gonna be a good day like i said don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button you know share comment i'll do my best to comment back Oh, looky there. I see a face that I recognize. Right there. She's right there. Look at there. Look, there's Kobe Dale. Uh, she walked ahead. You can't see him just yet. So, anyways, um, are we all going in together or what? I guess. Y'all got cash? Yeah, just uh, so apparently. Look at Kobe. Hey, buddy. You going to the pumpkin patch? Yeah. All right. Oh, dude. It's all right. We're here. It's gonna be a good day, folks. Look at that big old cack over there. Uh, rooster. Yeah, he's on top of the pumpkins. That wasn't there the last time he came, was he? Uh, I'm not sure if it was or not. Um, I don't think it was. Got a big corn maze going on. Actually, Looks like we got some uh, sunflowers you can go take a picture of. You kind of see it over there. You kind of see all the people. I didn't want to put them in here. Uh, same thing. 
turkey. Well, if that's a turkey, then, uh, yeah. <laughs> He's like, well, my son's a I said that by accident. That wasn't there. I don't think so, mister. Oh my lord. What? All right, folks. Well, <clears throat> we're going to get inside here and then uh, we'll reconnect. Uh, I'm going to get off here just for a second. All right, I had to come back. We're still in line, but there's some really awesome scenery going on over here. Got some really cool pumpkins. Um, got some really pretty sunflowers. And a lot of people. This place has like literally been open less than, well, right at 30 minutes right now. And there's already probably 300 people inside, another 200 in line, and uh, about a quarter mile long line of cars waiting to get in here. This is a very unique and uh, popular place. Um, this is our second year of coming here, and uh, we didn't come last year. It rained too much, but we come the year before, and we was able to get like right in and toured the place, and it was very beautiful. The staff here is so friendly. Like I said, once again, we're at Hall's Pumpkin Patch. Um, I believe it's uh, got a grapevine address. That's what's on my GPS. I'm not sure. I'll ask somebody once I get in, but um, it's a very uh, beautiful place. Like I said, the staff is really, really friendly and uh, they really take care of uh, the place around here. You can tell by yeah, just the way everything is nice and organized. And oh my goodness, I gotta show you this guys. This Look at this line. Um, it wasn't half that long 10 minutes ago. Look at that. You got uh, sunflowers. Um, Look like some daisies coming up. Uh, there's the corn maze. Um, I don't know if we're gonna do that today or not. It'd be nice, you know, if the whole family go in there. We'll see. We're gonna see two for one dollar. Um, buy your, look, it's buy fresh cut flowers. You go in there and pick the flowers, cut them, and you pay, yeah, two for a dollar. So you can get two sunflowers for a dollar, you get two of those. Uh, Oh, five for a dozen. Well, that's the way to go. See, get your lady some flowers. I might have to do the same thing. Yeah, it's very pretty. And I'm sure at night it's really nice. See, so got all these lights strung up, you know, um, picnicking places to kind of hang out, get some water, chit chat with your family, or, you know, whatever you please. I can't express it enough. This is a very beautiful place. Um, if you have not been to Hall's Pumpkin Patch yet, you need to come. Uh, it's free parking, um, $5 a person. Um, three and under is free. So if you got, you know, the little kids and this is their first time, they're free. I mean, even if they're over three, I mean, $5. Just the experiences. It's worth that to me, you know, just to see a kid smile. It really is. Like this right here. Kobe, you ready to go to a pumpkin patch? See that? That's worth five dollars right there. So, but all right, um, I'm coming up to the stand where I gotta pay, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pay, get in, and once we get in and get settled, um, I'll bring you folks right back, you know, to the action. All right, folks. We have made it inside and oh my lord this is just absolutely beautiful they got pumpkins everywhere you just kind of grab you one and uh i guess i don't know what the pricing is yet but you just walk up and grab you one. Oh, here you go right here here you go folks they got them right here um looks like two dollars for the little one uh six dollars and up on that medium one um what is that six dollars and up eight dollars for one like that ten 15. I might have to give me a big one like that. You know, that's really not that bad. But yeah, they got the prices on them. Like I said, man, if you've never been to Hall's Pumpkin Patch, y'all need to come out and enjoy. They got stands here. They got sweet tea. They got a, what was that over here? It's called the Crow Bar. You get hayride tickets there. 
Um, got a little farmer's market set up. This is a very nice place. Uh, if you've never been, y'all need to come out to ha uh, Hall's Pumpkin Patch. It's in uh, Grapevine, Texas. It's a very nice, uh, very nice place, folks. If you've never been, you need to come out just for the experience. The staff is really friendly and sweet. Like I said, you know, any questions that I've asked, they've always been really helpful and really respectful. Can't ask for much of that because it's hard to come by nowadays. They got a little place over here. Looks like for the kids. Uh, we'll check it out here more. Just a minute, I'm gonna use the restroom. We'll be right back. Folks, this little space over here looks like they got a candles, souvenir, t-shirts, jam and jelly. Uh, like I said, they got this place really, really fixed up. They got a uh, hay rise, which I think I've already showed you this. Um, some sweet tea. We'll go ahead and we'll buy me and mama sweet tea real quick. Yes, I am. Let's see what we got here. Hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? I'll take a sweet tea, please, ma'am. I just want to be good. Thank you so much. This place is really nice. And the staff is really nice and friendly. Thank you. I mean, look at this. Oh my lord. It come in a mason jar you get to keep. It come with a fancy straw. This is really nice. Um, all right, let's go find the family. Um, <sighs> whew, this place is big. I have to get some pictures of Grayson over here on these pumpkins. This is this is fantastic. This is beautiful. They got a little jungle gym for the kids to climb on. We're gonna pick us up some pumpkins. Oh, that? dear Lord, I got that just for you, babe, see? What is that? Sweet tea, $5, but you get to keep the mason jar, they told me. What's up, Kobe? Did you find your mom? She's over there. She has a bunch of flowers. She's over where? Sitting down? In the flowers. Oh, well, then let's go. Let's go get us some flowers. Let's go pick some flowers. This won't fit in there? Why don't she just go do it? Because she has a baby. You're not. This won't fit in there? That's all right. Because you're a good kid and you're the youngest. What's all right? There's you can't a, take him over there? Yes. Well, then what's the problem? She'll be talking to my baby about going to the pond. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Must be mom. This is Trey. How you doing? Hi. Trey, Jose. nice to meet you, Jose. <laughs> nice to see you again. <laughs> Had to bring the camera for this. This is beautiful. Carl's <laughs> mom and uh, Mr. Jose. <laughs> Man, so you already went and picked the flowers? Sure oh, you sure. got it for her. Ah. Sure That's what I was telling him. I said, you got to go pick the lady some flowers, man. Yeah, we did already. For her and your wife. Yeah, those are pretty. Oh, well, thank you. Yeah, those are very pretty. Yeah. Yeah, we saw it from the road. You know, this is our third attempt to be out here. Where do you guys park? Way in the back. We just parked over there. Did you? Yeah. That's what I'm telling him. We should have parked and walked across. We tried to do it yesterday, but the whole neighborhood was just backed up. Oh, yeah, it is terrible. Man, I can't believe, though. You know, they opened at 1 and, what, one fifteen. the mile, the line was already almost to the highway. But, you know, it's worth the wait once you get in here. Look at all these flowers over here. Oh, this is beautiful. Got the maze over there. All right, we're going to visit for a minute, and then we'll uh, pick back up here uh, shortly. We'll go look at some pumpkins. Kobe, Kobe, look at him. He's he's all happy <laughs> and he's nervous and scared. Most kids are their first time. Uh, 
so. Pumpkins, man, check out this pumpkin right here. That is hey, look, some kind of wicked. That's that's wicked, dude. That's cow's brain. I'll tell you what, I want to get a, uh, I want to find a pumpkin that's got a really tall stem. Really tall stem. Oh, look at there. I think I found the perfect oh, look, pumpkin. Look. Right there. Or look. Oh, no, look at, look at the King Daddy pumpkin right here. Oh yeah, my this lord. One's, this one's tall and skinny. No, look at this. Look at the stalk on that thing. Oh, look, there's a little tiny white pumpkin. We could get that for Grayson. Oh, we could get those for Grayson. Yes. Yeah, that's, that's real pretty right there. All these different types of pumpkins. and They just got little stations. They got, you know, they got a lot of props for taking pictures. That's a lot of props. Taking. You can take a lot of pictures out here. They did a really good job, guys. This is Hall's Pumpkin Patch in Grapevine, Texas. <clears throat> they got skinny pumpkins, short pumpkins, fat pumpkins, some really weird potato head looking pumpkins. Um, these are some small, you know, pretty much all the same size. But look at this pumpkin right here. It looks like Mr. Potato Head. Yeah, right there. Which one? Well, I think we're gonna do some uh, pumpkin picking, hang out with the family for a little bit, and uh, be right back. Okay, guys, we've been lost for about 30 minutes or so, I guess. Which way is it? We can go that way. We've taken so many wrong turns, but this is actually a pretty nice uh, setup they got here. Corn you can't see over. This is probably a dead end. It's a dead end. What's it? Oh, and it. And the rest of my bunch is coming from. Yeah, here they come. Here comes T Man, Carla, and yeah, the rest of them. This has been a good day today. Yeah, guys, it's been a beautiful day. Come out to the pumpkin patch with the family. I had no idea that we was meeting up with uh, Carla's mom and, uh, and uh, I think that's her boyfriend, girl, Jose. Stepdad, I'm sorry. Guy. And uh, we're over there taking pictures by the sunflower and I was in the stroller, had some flowers fall off and I went to pick them up. And it's this way. Turned around and Tyler was down on one knee, proposed to Miss Carla. So here we go, folks. We've made it to the end. We survived together.